Hello everyone, this is Chris with Sickervab. It's been a very, very busy day and I am completely done except for one more install. Still tearing down the roof. Had to get in here after hours to get my vehicle or get this customer's vehicle in the driveway. Um, what we are doing today is we're going to overlay that steering wheel emblem. Uh, we've, I finally made a vinyl that fits right there, but we're going to need a screwdriver, the vinyl, you'll get two of these and a hair dryer. So let me get everything set up and then let's go into this installation. All right, use a microfiber cloth, some interior spray or anything that won't leave uh, any residue uh, in this installation area. You wanna make sure this is all free of armor all and stuff like that because you know it leaves everything shiny but it also makes things not want to stick in your interior. Uh, grab that vinyl. It'd be good if your hands were nice and clean. Uh, right now, it's probably between 70 and 80 degrees. That is the ideal uh, insulation temperature. Of course, the vinyl is 70 to 80 degrees. The surface is 70 to 80 degrees. Um, if you have to do this in the cold, make sure the vinyl is up to that 70 to 80 degree range along with your interior. So if you're in the north, especially around this time, we're shooting in December, be sure that everything is nice and warm. The most complaints I get are from people where they can't obtain an ambient temp of 70 to 80 degrees. Take your vinyl. You don't have to place it on your screwdriver. Let's just let's just wing it. You can also wet the back of this so that you can slide it around during the install and then just dry it out with that hair dryer. Can't really talk today, a little tired. Okay. Now you're gonna take your screwdriver and you're just gonna kinda of tuck in certain areas that overlay the silver. And that's kinda of how you get the full coverage on this. Made it a little bit bigger so that you get full coverage. This emblem that you're overlaying is three dimensional and that's why we have to use heat to really get it down. You can see we're doing a pretty good job here without the heat getting into some of these three dimensional areas. Once we add heat, it'll be a lot better. And again, if you're up north, this will really be essential. Just continue to work all around this little pony. My little pony. This is the smallest screwdriver I have from, you know, one of those little screwdriver sets you can find anywhere. I got this one on Amazon, but these are the typical ones you find like at drugstores or just anywhere. Instead of dragging the screwdriver, I'm kind of just going in at different locations. All right, now I'm gonna apply a little heat. Use my fingers to push down on this.
You can see that three-dimensional texture really coming out now that I've applied the heat. Nice and warm. Come back with my screwdriver. We kind of have it. We have it fully installed. All right, so check that out. All the other blue in our interior, and now we've added the overlay for the center of the steering wheel. Looking pretty good. You can find this on our website at sickerfab.com. Thank you guys for all your suggestions and all your uh, inquiries that you made, your purchases and whatnot. Please like this video like every other video. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell notification icon to see the latest and greatest things we have come out and installed on our Ford Bronco.